Uh, today we're giving a introduction of our new software and hardware, Machine Sync, which is the software, and Machine Communication Radio, which is the hardware that enables Machine Sync. Uh, with this technology, it enables the combine to control the tractor via speed control. And the great usability of this is for harvest logistics, number one. Now that operators in the combine and in the tractor can see where each other are located in the field at all times and real-time information. And uh, overall, harvest logistics is improved in this. And just like AutoTrack, also sold by John Deere, the stress release that it provides our people in the field, whether it's in the tractor or the combine, it really helps reduce that stress and able to concentrate on other things that are going on in that field. So the hardware components that are going to be needed is so for you have a tractor and you have the combine. Um, and this at the time is a green on green advantage. You're going to be needing uh, GS. 32630s. Uh, those displays is needed because it takes Robot. Ethernet capability and only our 2630 display enables Ethernet capability. And that will be needed in the tractor and the combine. In both the tractor and combine you'll also be needing a receiver. It can work with the ITC or Starfire 3000. However, if you're running with an ITC it's going to require RTK. And however, if you're running Starfire 3000 you can run off SF1, SF2 or RTK. Then you're going to be needing auto track, only required on the tractor. Then the machine sync activation is going to be required on the combine and the tractor. And then the hardware called machine communication radio required on the combine and the tractor. This will be available um, early spring 2012.